All right, welcome Windows 10 users. It's me, KB, and today I think we have got the Windows 10 1909 update. So I heard the news this morning. So let's check it out. Okay, go to your settings and check for updates. Yes, it is here as a optional updates available. So you can see feature update to Windows 10 version 1909. Yep. It's here. That's how you get it. So yeah, let's start the process actually. So I'm just gonna click on download and install now. I don't know how big that thing is. We can do the Google search for that. It's, it's okay. Just in case if I need to restart my PC, I have my phone ready here to capture the moments when it's like installing, you know, how long it takes and all that kind of stuff. And you know, we'll know what happens after you install this update. So as of now, this update is not being forced by Microsoft. So it is a good thing that as of now, this update is as a optional update. So yeah, if you want to update it right now, then you can just click download and install. I, I, and I'm, I'm doing it right now, you can see, because I want the latest windows as always. So if as you know, as you know the history, every single feature update of Windows 10 is trash. Sometimes you get some type of bug. So yeah, I hope this time it won't happen because this update, as far as I heard from the other people, this update is smaller. And uh, yeah, that's it. It's all about bug fixes and all that kind of stuff. So hope nothing is gonna go wrong okay please windows 10 1909 don't crash my pc this time i mean none of the update crashed my pc but uh, you know i don't have to talk too much so it says installing is it already downloaded we are talking here like it's been like one minute not even yeah it's been one minute and it says installing so since this is a feature update it might take some time even though this is the smallest feature update that we have ever got for Windows 10. And my phone is ready. Boys, if I need to restart, don't worry. I will continue the video with this phone, okay? All right, it's a, what? It's going really fast. Wow. What? I think this is really small. After we restart, we will check out that, okay? So first I need to turn off my... Um, wait a second. Let me set up my phone first okay looking good okay i'm just gonna turn off these okay see you in a bit guys all right from the phone yay so i'm just gonna go and hit restart unexpected really unexpected because you know the feature updates are always really big but this one is like so tiny really tiny it took like 30 seconds to get downloaded. I didn't even saw the downloading, something like that. It, the status was always installing, straight installing. Wow, my PC got turned off because I'm updating. <laughs> okay, looking good. All right, starting. Yeah, I think this update is a good update. This update is not a devil update like other updates. So this update is going to be smooth and easy to install. Yeah, that's it. Restarting one more time. Okay. So this is the process, guys. And don't worry, after this, if you don't get the Windows 10 1909 update in your update settings, then there is a way. Okay, There is always a way to do things differently. So yeah, after this, I'm going to show you that. Oh no, I didn't mean to zoom 2x. I just want to focus there. Come on, yeah, just like that, my boy. All right, it's looking good. <laughs> I guess it's taking time. Oh, what? I have to, all right, putting my password. Guys, don't see my password, okay? All right, everything is turned on. Now let me switch to the PC side. Okay, let me open the OBS and after that, see you there. All right, I'm back and uh, let's check for updates one more time. 
maybe there is another updates like driver updates or something like that I don't think so but uh, let's go about your PC and yeah this is the Windows 10 version 1909 and it was so tiny so tiny I it felt like I installed a regular updates like security updates or something like that so which is a good thing by the way so yeah there is no update after this and that's it that's it so there's a new thing like you can see in the start menu when you hover your mouse to these icons it will automatically expand yeah and uh, I don't know nothing new not too much as I said I have made a video about this already and as I said this feature update is mainly focused on bug fixes and improvements so yeah that's it now let's talk about the people who are not getting this update in updates section how they can get it so if you visit the official site of the microsoft where you can get the windows 10 november update aka windows 10 1909 update so you will see there is no option for that yet so it will take some time to you know get the tool for windows 10 1909 or november update so you can get this update now tool and after that you can update so that's the one thing and actually you can get the iso file of the windows 10 1909 right now so let me show you how so open up your you know google chrome and after that right click and click on inspect okay once you click on inspect just click on this device toggle like you know this is this changes the device settings for the web so i'm going into the mobile version of this website so i'm just gonna click on this that toggle device toolbar okay once you do that after that just refresh the page just like that and after that you can close this inspection tool and here you will have a different site like different style of site this is actually a mobile version of this website so from here you can see we have the option of select edition i have actually made a video on how to get the windows 10 iso file directly so i will also put link in the description for that you can go there and get the windows 10 iso file this is the same method so to get the windows 10 1909 aka november update just click on select edition you can see when we go visit the site in mobile or mobile version you can see we have the november update of iso sadly we don't have the assistant tool like assistant update tool but we do have a uh, iso file available for everyone so you can see it says windows 10 november update 2019 so i'm just gonna click on that and confirm and after that gonna choose the language okay english confirm and uh, yeah it's going to give us the link to download the windows 10 iso file of windows 10 1909 iso file actually so if you have a 32 bit download that if you have a 64 bit download that and that's it that's how you can get the windows 10 actually i'm gonna have to download the 64 bit because now let's talk about the problem okay so there might be other problems but this problem is really big for me okay so yeah that's it that's how you get the windows 10 1909 file and the problem what i have encountered right now with the windows 10 1909 is that obs studio display capture does not work you can see i'm using the obs studio to capture the webcam it works fairly good good very good but i'm gonna open the obs studio and uh, I'm going to try to capture the display. Actually, I have already added. You can see nothing is working. So when I click on plus, I can add the display capture and hit OK. You can see nothing is showing up. It's just blank. So I even reinstalled my OBS Studio and did everything 
nothing is working i don't know why but for some reason i'm not able to record my display using obs studio okay i even tried streamlabs okay you, you can see i'm just gonna open the streamlabs obs studio and it's not working i don't know why and these are the most important tools for me because i record the screens every single day and after the update of windows 10 1909 i can't i can't record i don't know why okay so you can see i have added the display capture i even added one more time like display capture add source you can see this is just blank okay nothing is happening i can't record my display so i know some people like uh, even if you run this like uh, if you have a dual graphic card like a uh, intel graphic card which is integrated graphics and nvidia processor so if you have a dual graphic card you have to choose the integrated graphics to record the display in windows actually so i'm just gonna choose this and gonna run the obs i have tried all the tricks and nothing is working so i had to download this uh software called sharex to record this right now so in sharex software it's working but uh, i like obs but for some reason after the update i can't use the obs so i will make a a update video after this what are the major problems in windows 10 1909 after the update so yeah for now that's it uh, i showed you this because i encountered this problem just now you know i was about to record just straight record my this video uh, after i switched from my phone but suddenly i noticed that my obs studios display capture is not working so i uninstalled my obs studio and after that i reinstalled it didn't work i even tried streamlabs obs and it didn't work so i did whole like 10 minutes of research and tried everything but nothing worked so yeah maybe there is a, some type of bug or problem with the display capture in windows 10 1909 but i'm not too sure what's that but yeah that's it as i said i will make a update video on the problem with windows 10 1909 so stay tuned for that okay first i need to reinstall my windows because i can't live without obs and this is really sad yes i'm about to reinstall my windows 10 and i will post a picture on community post you can do that you know so if you want to keep eye on that i will i will do it for sure okay once i install and after that i will update you that i have done it okay <laughs> that's enough so yeah that's it so i will put a link in the description for my site where i have showed you guys that how to download the windows 10 iso file so using that method you can actually get the entire windows 10 1909 iso file and yeah i don't know there as i said i'm really confused this update is so small it shouldn't have any problems but you know it just got released so i'm sure there will be some serious problems and bugs so as i said my display capture is not working in obs or any screen recorders expect this share x so i'm really sad that i have to reinstall my windows 10 it's gonna take entire day so for now that's it hope you enjoyed it i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun and i will put the good links in the description required links ta ta bye bye